this device is composed by several components. The first part is a table, an anti-vibration table, that enables us to cancel out all mechanical vibrations, since neurons are very sensitive to noise. Neurons are electrical chemical systems, therefore it is imperative to shield out all electromagnetic uh, radiations, since these can affect neural activity. So the first part that is put on the table, in fact, is the uh, base of the microscope. This is a highly sophisticated microscope that enables us to see um, neurons within a neural tissue. Neurons are very small, uh, with approximately a diameter of 50 micrometer, and therefore we need such types of microscopes. Another component that is actually coupled to this system is the robotic arm, uh, whereby uh, we can fix an electrode system that allows to both measure the activity of neurons, but also elicit, stimulate activity on neurons. Um, to the microscope, we fix several parts of it, the uh, lens, uh, the focusing lens, and uh, finally, on top of it, we fix a camera. Um, the activity of neurons is read out by electrodes. This activity goes on to the amplifier which amplifies the activity of neurons and finally a digitizer that converts these analog signals onto a digital um, signal which is then sent to a computer.